a pit bull on the loose tonight after it pounced on a woman and her dog and attacked. It happened near Fire Station 45 in Fort Apache. That's near Grand Canyon in Alexander. New Tonight Action News reporter Drew Caritas tells us how some good Samaritans fought back. A sidewalk stained red marks the frantic struggle outside Fire Station 45. A woman and her Springer Spaniel caught in a pit bull's grasp. It came from this direction, and when it did, it ran up to the dog, and so I ran after the dog when it went up to the lane, and she was right here going up, trying to keep it away from the dog. She's yelling at it. She's trying to push it away herself, and then it started to get a hold of the dog, so that's when I came up, and I took a bottle I had with, like, a, a chocolate drink I had, and I shot it at the dog trying to do that. Many Weezer spotted the pit wandering a nearby street and walked into the fire station, but in a split second, the dog he was rescuing was now the dog he was fighting. What I started to do was kick the dog and try to kick in its head, to get it off of the, the other uh, lady's dog. Firefighter Zach Abley ran out trying to pry its teeth off the spaniel and the pit bull clamped onto his arm. It was tough. It was a tough, tough battle with this dog. A fire extinguisher became the next method of defense. The bat was actually in the dog's mouth. Yes, he jumped up to bite it and I sprayed him and he bit it and I sprayed him again. As everybody hustled inside for safety, the pit bull tried to follow. This is the residue from the last spray of the fire hydrant that prevented the dog from getting inside. So they train you guys to fight fires. Do they train you guys to spray dogs with a fire extinguisher? No, this was something that just came into my head. The city believes the dog bolted from this home during an eviction. They had just seized this other pit bull from that residence earlier in the day. Hours later, a bloody attack that could have had a grim ending if some brave Samaritans hadn't jumped into action. And that woman and the firefighter with the cast you heard from were both treated for cuts and scrapes. The Springer Spaniel was also hurt, and we're not sure if that dog is doing all right tonight, but I can tell you Animal Control is launching a 10-day patrol trying to get that pit bull off the streets. No word on any charges for the owner. We're live at the newsroom, Drew Caritas, Channel 13 Action News.